flickering legs as he brings them out of a slight midsection bend to go straight. Luka Boyants of Slovenia. Third best performer in qualification with a score of 13.35. He's never won World Cup honours. He has competed in around 20 events, the 26-year-old. It's now about how he controls the nerves, knowing that he's a legitimate contender. Good rise from Maltese up into planche. Transitions to the Iron Cross, good shoulder presentation. Jonasson up into the planche, has to bring the back leg of the back up and the uh, legs up a little. Yamawaki to handstand, he has to really fight to get that. Oh, it's going to be interesting. It's going to be interesting. It's a nice routine with some original composition. There was a handstand that he showed ferocity to establish and uh, a straddle planche where he had to raise the legs to match the shoulder line otherwise the execution was really good from Luka Boyans he could get close He's from the southeast of the country, near the border with Croatia. That's where there was that little rise up from Maltese into straddle, uh, into a planche, excuse me, and it really is such a difficult skill. And there, the flickering legs as he brings them out of a slight midsection bend to go straight did very well to establish it great shoulder line that was really strong in the iron cross that's the handstand that he had to work into to make it a full position otherwise it risks not being credited for it 13.3 it is a little down from the preliminary round by five hundreds execution is a third place Luca Boyans Slovenia Luca Boyans of Slovenia is the bronze medalist in front of his home crowd for the first time ever he's made a World Cup podium it's taken him about twenty attempts to do it Absolute determination. The 26 year old will cherish this moment and he's right to. And look at the company he's keeping on that podium as well. Ilya Kovtun, the winner of the silver medal. Two gold medals and one silver in three events today. Not too shabby, that is it. <laughs> Not too shabby at all. First place, Igor Radivilo, Ukraine. It's one of the veteran rings performers who's managed to take the title. Igor Divilov, over 20 gold medals won in World Cup competition. And as a result, we will hear in his honour the national anthem of Ukraine. The national anthem of Ukraine.
And there they are, the medalists in the rings competition in Copair.